Hi, you already prepared sales budget and production budget in the previous video. Now, you will be learning to prepare the direct material budget. These are all related information to prepare the budget. You will start the budget with the required production unit. Now, refer to the production budget previously prepared, you can get the number from the budget. As stated in the information given, each product unit requires 2 kg of raw materials. You need to multiply the requirement with the required production units to get the needed raw materials for the production. Next, you will be planning for the desired ending direct material. As stated in the information, the desired ending direct material will be 10% from the next quarter of the needed direct materials. You will multiply both numbers for every quarter. For the last quarter, the ending direct material will be multiplied with the first quarter of next year's needed direct materials. To get this number, you need to decide first the expected sales for the next two quarters of next year's sales. Assuming the sales increase 500 every quarter, 5000 and 5500 will be the next expected sales. Multiply the 20% which is desired policy for ending goods with the next quarter of sales. You will get the number and later add with the expected sales to get the total required units. The beginning goods for first quarter of next year's sales is the ending goods for fourth quarter of the year. You already have the number for required production unit for first quarter of next year. Get the total needed of direct material first. Later, multiply the 10% with the first quarter of needed direct material. Finally, there is the desired ending direct material for the last quarter of the year. By combining the desired ending direct material with the needed direct material, you will get the total direct material required for every quarter. Next, you will decide the beginning direct material for the first quarter. To get this number, you need to assume the desired ending direct material for the last quarter of previous year. By multiplying 10% with next needed direct material of next quarter. You will get number for the last quarter. Later, the number is the beginning direct material for first quarter of the year. You will be doing the same thing for the rest of quarters. Next, get the total kg of direct material to be purchased for every quarter by deducting the beginning direct material from the total material required. 
To get the total cost of direct material to be purchased, you need to multiply the cost per kg with the respective direct material in kg to be purchased for every quarter. When come to the total part, please be reminded that the ending direct material is the last quarter of ending materials and the beginning material is coming from the first quarter of beginning materials. Finally, you will get the total of direct material purchases for the year. Please be noticed, you supposed to get the same total of purchase when you calculate the total vertically or horizontally. So, this is your direct material budget. You have done your direct material budget. Now, moving to the direct level budget. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.